So, you remember that YouTube video I made like a week ago? Yeah, this one. How to be a giant black rat in Robloxy in high school. Well, one of my subscribers has told me that a big YouTuber called Flamingo has used my creation. Flamingo. No. Way. <laughs> Who is it, a pineapple under the sea? Yes, it's SpongeBob. Hi, I'm SpongeBob, and welcome to Bikini Bottom. Wait, this isn't Bikini Bottom? You guys do this to me every time. So, you want to look like SpongeBob inside of Robloxy in high school? Then you've come to the right place. So, let's keep the introduction as short as possible, just in case, you know, any uh, flamingos might be watching. And, uh, yeah. Let's flippin' do this. So go on, ask me. I know what you're gonna ask. Wait, I didn't think you were gonna ask me that. I thought you was gonna ask me how my day was. Anyway, my day was fantastic. Thanks for asking. So this is the finished result we are going for. As you see on the screen, it's like a cheering SpongeBob. We got the arms coming out of his shirt sleeves. We got the body. The shoes look kind of weird, but it is without a doubt the best SpongeBob I have seen so far. So let's begin making him. And as always, we start by clicking the reset avatar button and clicking where to bring ourselves back to our normal selves. Hey mom, and here we go. That is a very handsome looking avatar, uh, but it is not the result that we are going for. So uh, the first thing we need to do is literally remove everything that we're wearing. So I have the hat uh, well the hair. I've got the cape on and I need to remove it because uh, SpongeBob doesn't have a prickly cape on. So here we flipping go. Click up here where it says body. Come over to the wearing uh, box, which is just there. Then what you need to do now is remove the hair and the uh, cape. And to do that, you come over to where it says tuning at the top right. And you have loads of boxes here or maybe just one. You might one. But loads of boxes drop down all the things you're wearing. For example, if I had a hat on. On. That would now be here as well And we just need to remove it by clicking these boxes like that and as you can see now I am bald Anyway, now we have removed everything that we are wearing except our clothes because that would be really weird It is time to start equipping some things to make us look like a SpongeBob So the first thing we need to do is come up to us is wearing come over to the body selection right here And now we need to change our body to look like SpongeBob's body to step one You need to come up to where it says heads right here And then you need to click this empty box which is actually called the headless head You can alternatively search headless and then click the empty box and it will make your head disappear just like that the next step is another really really simple step guys come to where it says right leg and search woman in here and equip the woman leg for both the right and the left leg and that is all of the adjustments we need to make here right now but we do need to do some scaling so click where it says scaling at the top right click advanced and now you need to do everything i do first of all open up the height Open up the upper body height and what we want to do is make the upper body torso height around there and make the upper arms height down. We're going to do this for both all three of the bottom ones, but the torso height is going to be taller, maybe a bit more just like that. Now we're going to do the same for the lower body height. We're going to make the torso taller like that, but we're going to drop all these other three down just like that now once we've done that we need to minimize this too and open up the width panel and we're going to do the exact same thing we're going to make the torso a bit wider like that and drop all of these down just like that and we're going to do the same for this as well the lower body make the torso wider about there i think is right we just sort of line these two up here just like that and then drop these down like that and make sure they're all the way down just like that and you should be looking just like this and now if you're looking roughly like this it doesn't have to be 100% but if you are looking just like this then you are doing a good job and it's time to start making this look like Spongebob and to do that is really simple so what we need to do is come up to where it says body come over to the wearing selection at the top left come over to the pants selection and click custom pants at the top left and once you do that you'll get this drop down box right here and you're going to want to input the following custom url which is a series of digits and if you do this correctly then this will pop up right here the spongebob pants now once you've done that simply click where and as you can see i now have uh, spongebob legs but i don't have a top and the way we get the top half of spongebob we come over to where it says shirts here and you will have a roblox orange shirt here simply click it 
and kaboom, SpongeBob has magically appeared. Now, once you are at this point, it is time to now change the color of our arms. So click where it says wearing, come over to the body selection, click colors, and then you have to click the yellow one right there. Then come to this down here and slightly change the color to make it a bit lighter, just like this. And now you're probably thinking, well, his arms are just floating off his body and he usually has shoulders on the side. We can fix that. Come up to where it says body, come over to the wearing tab. We're back in the wearing tab now. Come to the shoulders, guys, and you're going to want to equip these right here. They are called the snowman head row and just simply equip them. Click tuning. Once you have equipped the snowman head rows, and now what we need to do is open up the rotation Drop this to down, the up and down one in the middle, drop it to down, minimize it, open up the position and bring it down. Now you can make this bigger or smaller depending on how you want it, but uh, something like that should be just fine. And guys, that is it. Not unless it's Spongebob's birthday, then he needs a party hat. But yes, guys, that is going to be it from me today. If you guys did enjoy this video, then please do hit the subscribe button to join the most awesome flipping family on YouTube. Alternatively, leave a like or comment in the comment section down below, letting me know if there's anything you want to see inside of this game. I'm going to put two videos on the screen of some awesome creations I have already made for you guys to check out. But if I don't happen to see you in one of those videos, then hopefully I see you all in the next one. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching. Bye!